All right, so today is Wednesday, March the 7th, 2018. Um, it is 10.52 in the morning, and we are at Enchanted Rock outside of Fredericksburg, Texas. And you can see we're about to start the loop trail. It's something in the vicinity of about four and a half miles. And uh, I can climb at your own risk. See, there's two people coming off of it there. Print for camping is two miles. So we're going to do this whole loop. I'll be able to show you the Enchanted Rock from all the way around it. And so as we see more interesting things, we will definitely go with that. All right, you see this rock right here in front of us? See that big space through that? As, uh, as it was just said to me, and I agree with it, if those top rocks up there, they went up a little further, this would look like a giant heart with, uh, with the arteries cut off coming out of the top of it. So let's go around. See if we can investigate this just a little bit from around here. There you go. Get a better view of it that way. And then you can see just the view out here. It's all kinds of boulder fields all the way around. And if you can see those people up there, that's what we're heading up that way. See the crack in that right there? is a good size crack. All right, so from around this side, see, much more open there. Little tree growing out of it right there. And we'll get on the upper side of it. Here you go. There's even a little bit of a way to walk up there. And here we are, right in the middle of the heart. Here's our overview of the hill country and the Enchanted Rock area. And that would be the Enchanted Rock over there. Pop them on your screen now. So, not a bad view, huh? Not a bad view. All these great big boulders out here. Pretty cool indeed. And look at this old stump that was growing out of this thing. Pretty cool. All right, you see these two rocks in front of us, and hopefully you hear that there's a helicopter coming right towards us as well. Looks military to me. So, let's check him out as he comes by. he goes all right but anyway so far the trail has been pretty much what you see right here in front of us these great big rocks I take a picture of them they're nice way over there way past those dead trees there's a big flat rock way up there but I doubt that you could see it through this uh, GoPro but maybe I will get out here see it there maybe you can there's a tree grow on top of it so that's pretty cool they will get a picture of that that's also part of uh, Enchanted Rock right there straight in front of you in the middle of your screen so we'll eventually be heading up there so hang on with me just a minute we'll look at something else all right so we've come to the scenic loop trail and we've we've come to our scenic view excuse me not scenic loop scenic view trail and uh, this is it from the top I'll give you a 360. We're looking out, you know, away from the park actually. Which go left around to the right. You can see all the various rocks and things here. That's the two big rocks that I just showed you over there. And right there, right past this lady in the pink hat, that is Enchanted Rock itself. That's what that is, just so you can have your bearings. 
And here we go on around. Back out to the area where we started, which is right there. Okay, so this, if you take this trail and you do the scenic view, this is exactly what you'll see. So, hope you enjoyed that part, and we'll wait till we go see the next thing. Okay, just wanted to show you a little bit of this walking trail here, and show you me coming down it. As you look around, you'll see there's a bunch of nice trees here, plane going overhead. Wow! Man, that guy was low. Did you catch that? That was crazy. But anyway, a little bit shady in through here, which is nice. It's gotten to the point where it's warming up and and uh, we've had to take our jackets off, tie them around us. Feels good, just a slight cool tint in the breeze and but this is the, this is the trail. You got to see a plane fly over us like crazy. See all these old trees. It's gonna make a scary movie scene. Enchanted Rock is over here to my right, front right. And we're just going along and having a good time. So when we get to see something more, I'll show that to you. So see you in a minute. All right, so here we've come to Moss Lake. Enchanted Rock right in front of you with the water. Sadly, no reflection. That's it to the left. That's it to the right. It's a bigger piece of land out there. We'll go through there. I do want to kind of sneak through where she's going. No, or, trail. no I think I think it just uh, loops around and, and then takes you out of here oh, okay. is what it is but like I said we can either go through there or might even go down water's edge and it's because I want to get out there on that big chunk of land okay. here we are at the water's edge and boy this does look like it's pretty deep pretty quick I gotta say Am I going to get in your way if I go over there? No, yeah, go ahead. Okay. All right, so we made it through all that. There's even a little place up here we could stand. But again, you can see Enchanted Rock in the water. So I'm going to make a few different shots of this. And we will see what we can get. All right, so hang with me for the next one. All right, so we've been walking on the trail for quite a, a little ways. But we've come up onto this little escarpment of a bunch of rocks. As you can see, some of these things are absolutely gigantic. I'm sure they don't look it on this GoPro, but take my word for it, they are. This is the trail. We're standing in the shade right now. And I'll just give you a little bit of the trail. So we've got some prickly pear here. And I can tell you that this park has got prickly pear everywhere. We have not seen not one javelina. And how there's not a million of them here is beyond me because all these prickly pear is some of their favorite food but here yeah we're coming to a little better opening right here see that right there that that one big rock right there I think it's the size of, of a small house literally it's that big you probably don't look at like I said on this GoPro but it's huge it's these trees here got really nice trees in this place and see you can see over here and that that right there is this side of Enchanted Rock. So, I want to show you that, make sure you see that. They have these little things all the way out. That one says number 26. And at first you think those correspond to the map, but, but they don't. There has to be some little booklet that will tell you, I guess, of all these little points of everything that comes off. Let me show you here. Here's just, uh, this is off the trail, but yeah, there's a little water here. I thought there was, because we're going to about to cross some water. It's not much, but hey, it's something. See it running? See it's coming from up there. It's crossing the trail where we're going to go. There's a little birdie over there on that rock you, you just flew. Hopefully this caught that. But listen for a second for the water. Okay, I hope you heard that. That's, uh, that's nice and sound. And yeah, I don't know if you can see it or not, but through these... Two trees here where this is open right through those rocks. There's a little pool of water down there. So, and I'm sure it just flows on to someplace else, but that's nice. We might go check that out. So, hang on with me just a minute. All right, 
what I'm pointing you at, that's where we came from. That's where I just was getting some video from. Listen to the water sound. Kind of that water I showed you. It's just coming down through. I know you can't see it, and I can't either from this point. But it comes to right here. And this is what I just showed you from up there. This is bigger than I thought, and this is a nice little oasis. It's all of this. It's all of this, and I think that part right there has got to be a minimum of two, potentially three feet deep right there at its deepest point. And then it actually goes on around, and you can see all of that. And then out through there. I'm sure it's running down through there. Yeah, you can see some water there that it's it's running on out and, you know, going to points further. But let me back up here and show you. See this? Is this not a nice little oasis? Look at the shade. See the shade on that rock right there? And then, of course, the water. All along it and the shade down in the water. And, of course, the sun hitting it as well. This is a nice little oasis. It's shady back in here. You can see quite a bit of shade. Uh, rocks you can sit around on or even down here. And if you're adventurous, you could actually sit right here on this rock and throw your feet down there along this rock here in the water. Oh, there's even a little sandbar you could get on if you wanted to fight those weeds and you could actually walk in the water right there. If you wanted a little little thinner on you. When it's warmer, it'd be a nice place to get in wade. Yep. Somebody's talking about swimming. You know, so we'll we'll see, but we're not gonna name any names, okay? No names. But these big rocks again, you can see these from up closer, those trees all up there. And the sky is perfectly blue. There's not a cloud in the sky today. Same same way it is a lot of times. So hope you enjoyed this part. We'll move on in a few minutes and Show you some more. All right, so we've come just a little ways and we've come down to this. We have got to cross water. So, you can see all the water here. There's water there and over there you can see they made a little man-made bridge of rock. And that right there is probably about a foot deep in its, in its deepest part, I would say. And then you can see it meanders on down through there. So you could go that way, but that's a big step. What I'm gonna do is go over here and I want to record this just in case something stupid happens, you know. But I'm going to step from here over to this. That was easy. Onto this rock. And then, you can see right here, this is the little bridge. And we're just going to step across these rocks. And I made it. Good and clear. Look at that, like an expert, like a guru. I'm going to walk up this way because we did see there's a signboard up here around this curve from we could see it back there when we were up a little higher. And uh, yeah, just a signboard. I can see most of it from here. But we think we're we got to be near the the end of the uh, loop trail here just so you can see again that is the enchanted rock up there so still off to our right there's that uh, board I was talking about we'll see what that says but I know we got to be very close to getting back now so I'll see you probably when we get to the end all right so the time is 204 if you look behind me you'll see it says loop trail back there that means we're done with this trail so a lot of stops a lot of neat things to see uh not a whole lot the last mile or so but overall the trail was definitely def worth it doing let's go over here and we'll take a look at this billboard see what's on it so yeah you can see welcome to enchanted rock state and natural areas up there take a hike to discover all the enchanted rock is and has to offer and right there you are here so that's us. If you remember, we, we, we actually parked here. We started right there. So we've gone all the way around this loop trail. And to be honest with you, we've gone down this Echo Canyon a couple of times getting to the lake. Oh yeah, Moss Lake right there. That's, that's all we did there. Come back all the way around. 
all the way back around and boom to there so now we just got to make our way through here up and over and we are literally about right there is where our car is at so finished 204 so that's this trail uh if you ever want to do it just take some good water uh maybe even a snack or two take your time and enjoy it because it can be fun so we'll see you in a little while because we are going to climb that behemoth that we have some lunch and i'll film that as well so that'll be the next video